Hello again, everyone. It's Vince Foer from TradeWinds.com, and this is our update for December 10th, 2017. Hope everyone's having a great weekend so far. Let's take a quick look at how the markets finished off last Friday. Early Friday morning before market opened, we did get the employment situation report out, which showed a stronger than expected U.S. labor market. So we saw 228,000 new jobs created last month compared to an expected number of 200,000. That certainly helped give the markets a boost. The Dow finished higher by 117 points on Friday, while the S&P 500, it was up 14 and a half. The Nasdaq gained a decent 27 points, and the Russell was higher as well by uh, a little over a point. <clears throat> um, aside from equities, bonds fairly quiet. Uh, but we did hold support here on TLT, the ETF Treasury uh, bond, uh, the, excuse me, the 20-year Treasury bond ETF is what I was trying to say there. Uh, while gold moved down slightly, this due to some, some more strength on the U.S. dollar, which we'll look at in just a moment. While crude regained uh, some upward momentum here and looks like it's on its way back to that 60 target. Crude oil futures were up 67 cents as of the official close on Friday. The U.S. dollar was stronger both against the CAD as well as if we have a look at the dollar index chart here uh, up against the basket of six other currencies. So it did pretty well there on Friday. Now, as we head into the holiday uh, season here, usually in December we, th we see things slowing down a little uh, so far, we haven't seen that at all. And we've got another fairly busy week ahead of us for news. Monday, we get the Jolts Report. Tuesday, PPI and Red Book. Wednesday is important. We get the MBA Mortgage Apps Number, uh, Consumer Price Index, and we get the FOMC Meeting Announcement, which uh, will be very, very interesting. Thursday, Jobless Claims, Retail Sales, Business Inventories, and Money Supply. And Friday, which is Quadruple Witching, by the way, uh, uh, and uh, we'll get the Baker Hughes rig count report. Now, before I let you go, I did want to let you know that within the email that you received to watch this video, there is a link for a free options trading ebook. Uh, this will be up for a very limited time. It's uh, a, an ebook that talks about a simple way to get started with options. So, for those of you getting started, or even you know if you've been trading options for a while. Uh, should be some great information in here. Just click on the link that you that is in the email that uh, you use to watch this um, uh, this video. Uh, that link will take you to this page. All you need to do is enter your email address, click Get Instant Access, and you'll be able to read this right away. Again, it won't be on forever. Uh, just limited time. Uh, but if you want a, a free options training ebook, just click the link in the email. Okay, that's about it for now. Enjoy the rest of your day, and we will see you on our next update.